Today I'm going to show you how to coil a rope. The first method I'm going to use today is the double butterfly coil. So what you want to do first is you want to flake your rope onto the ground or onto a tarp. Now flaking your rope is a great time to inspect your rope for any excessive wear or any inconsistencies in the rope and the core. So just run it through your hands and just feel the rope, check for any wear. Once you've reached the middle marker, you want to pull the length, both hands, then flick it over the back of your head to your neck, then drop it. The length should be around your waist. You want to repeat this again, so that are equal lengths. Once you're about three arm lengths off the end of the rope, you want to take the rope off the back of your neck and hold it in the centre so that both ends, the way coiled, are equal. You want to grab the three strand rope and wrap it around near the top and wrap it around in an upwards motion the top of the rope. You want to then get a bite of rope, both strands, and poke them through the middle. Like so, until you have a loop coming out the other side. And you want to flick this loop over the top and cinch the rope down. Now one of the additional bonuses to the coiling your rope this way is you can transport it as a rucksack as well between roots or off the top of a crag where you might not have a rucksack. So you just have to place this rope over the back of your head like so. Grab the two strap lengths which are like rucksack straps and wrap them around the back of the rope and tie it off to overhand knots then you're ready to descend from the crag or go to the next route.